let's assume there's one company on the JSE, just one. You take off the cross holdings, obviously it's difficult to have cross holdings with only one, but don't confuse a good story with it. <laughs> okay guys, if you want to, I'll make it two companies. So, okay. So you start off with what is available and possible investment of blacks in the JSE, and, and as I said earlier, the opposite side is that coin is, therefore, what is the white shell? Take off the 11, it's the same 11 as there, the 89. You take off the mandated and Trevor's, and this is where a lot of analysis has to go to, because clearly, the numbers that we have stated here for both black and white, and I'll try and give you numbers, are both understated, because there's a black and a white component in this. And if you take the population of South Africa, 88% black, 12% white, then half a brain says to you, the power of compound interest over a period of time starts telling you that a substantial portion of that has to be black. If it's not now, it certainly will be over the, over the long time. As Warren Buffett says, those people who understand compound interest earn it, those people who don't understand it pay it. Is 100% correct. <laughs> and there's a big compounding effect in there. So that one immediately makes every figure understated. Then we did there, and, and this is a proxy. Remember, this is DTI. I've got down the DTI thing there. Uh, the DTI, in its wisdom, said look at the foreign operations, uh, take a percentage of it, and take that off there. It's clearly a proxy. You come to a number, the 44, and then you say, okay, 8. And this is, this is the, the most firm number that we have yet today, the 8 and the 100. Because they've done the work, they've gone to the companies and said, what is your BEE shareholding? Not, the, well, not what is the makeup of your retail shareholding, because we don't know, guys. Because you, when you want to open a stock account, you don't have to say I'm black or white or male or female. We have to start making assumptions. Okay. Then you come to the 8%, which is fairly firm, but must change. You divide that over by 44, and you come to your 18%. So you, yours, you sir, you will say, give me a number. Well, then the first number I can try and give you is to say, and I prefer, although the DTI is going to look at the 18%, I say it's 8 and therefore the obvious question is, okay, therefore, what is the white shell? Well, clearly, guys, it has to be the 44 minus the 8. It has to be 36. If this is perfect, and nothing is going to change from here onwards, then today the number is 8% of the total is black, and therefore the maximum white component is 36 to the 40. That 44 minus that 8 is 36. Now, another way of looking at this, it's very similar with one change, is we say the total has to be 100. We haven't worked out a, a different way of getting to the total. It stays 100. The cross holdings, the analysis has been done, agree, it's 11. Therefore, you're back to 89. The mandated, done the numbers, Got no better suggestion, unless you guys have, agree it's 34. Take it off, and you're still at the 54. Now I say, if you're looking at what is available on the JSE for blacks or whites to buy, and if foreigners own 32%, which is more or less the number today, I've given numerous talks, John has asked me a thousand times what's the foreign ownership of the JSC, and I say it's between 30 and 40 guys. And it's subject to change. Today it's around about 32. So I put in 32 there, and then I am left with 22. 22% that is now not locked up in those cross holdings, is not locked up in all your pension funds, is not locked up, locked up, owned. None of these things are locked up by foreigners. In the JSE Limited, foreigners own 45% of the JSE Limited. So for, if our foreigners own that, then certainly it's not available today for black or white South Africans to buy. That leaves 22. Then your numbers become 
8 over, not 44, but 8 over 22, and 8 over 22 equals 36%. Now, don't get confused with that 36% and this 36% take different 36%. <laughs> okay, if you say, therefore, if you're looking for this 15 second thing, I oh, know, here comes trouble. Because you guys are going to get it wrong unless you go back and do your homework. But if the BE component is now 36% of the remaining available pot, then what is the white? Always has to be, if blacks own this, what are whites own? Well, it has to be the 22 minus the 8, and therefore that is the 14. Where do I write this now? 44 minus 8. There's the 36. 22 minus 8 is 14. Those are the numbers that you've got to get clear in your mind if you want to start explaining this to people. 